Yo, what's good with y'all, man? This is Jeffy K. Base. I'm back with her at Dragon Ball Xenoverse 2. And before I start the video, man, shout out to all the mothers out there on Mother's Day. You guys are the real MVP. So last time I tried to, actually, matter of fact, I tried to record a video like nearly five minutes ago. Bro, I could not connect to a game. I was going to do a couple of parallel quests, maybe one or two. Um... And I want to talk about Xenoverse 3. I'm, I'm going to talk about, so basically it's going to be like a little wishlist video as I'm playing the game. So I got that Super Saiyan, uh, I almost said Super Saiyan guy. I got that Super Saiyan Rose wig on. Now let's go ahead and do these uh, online parallel quests because I want to play with other people. Because I, uh, I played with this one guy today. I helped him out and... We just like ran through the parallel quest with ease. Like it didn't even take us that long. And the funniest part is like one like the hardest parallel quest. I think it was like the one before the really, DLC nigga? came out. Okay, now we're saying no room that magic condition was found. If this, if this doesn't work a couple times, I'm gonna go ahead and go do a parallel quest by myself. I might go do the one where I go fight against Frieza and try to get some Dragon Balls. And I'm gonna discuss uh the what. If I want to see a Xenoverse 3. I don't know why it's not working for some reason. Every time when I record, it does that, bro. Like, come on, bro. Come on, man. Jesus Christ. <laughs> Alright, let's see, son. Let me search a room. Don't specify a quest. Okay, about the same. Matter of fact, when I try it again, I'm gonna have the settings to all. Cause maybe I can just join someone, probably help them rank. What's good, nigga? So, Look at that, no room magic conditions was found. See, this one thing I want to talk about in this video, bro. See, in Xenoverse 3, they better fix these servers, yo. Because I remember the first time, bro, for both uh, particular Dragon Ball Xenoverse games, the servers were never, bro, I remember the, the, the second Xenoverse, the one I'm on now. Bro, literally the first time when I signed up for the beta, oh my god, bro. Do you know how long it took me to try to get inside one lobby? When I got in that lobby, I did not leave, bro. It took me at least like a like at least 50 tries to get into the lobby. Damn! There we go, bro. It's about time we get into somebody's lobby. Yo, what's his level? Level 25? Oh man, I'm about to, <laughs> I gotta help this guy out. But anyways, um, let me go ahead and talk about the stuff I want to see in Xenoverse 3. So you guys know how Super Saiyan's hair get all spiky and stuff. I hope Bandai can implement that to the game because that would be so dope if I could have Broly's Super Saiyan hairstyle because Super Saiyan Ascended Trunks has the same style as Broly. Like the same like hairstyle. So that would be kind of dope if our custom character's hair could finally spike up. Because, um, <clears throat> excuse me, on the PC version on Steam, you can mod the game. And you can literally have like spiked hair and everything, bro. Like it's so dope. But on the Xbox and PS4, you can't do that because on PC you can you can edit any type of way you want to. Okay, this match is gonna be so slow, bro. It's gonna be so slow. Okay, I didn't mean to meditate because if I punch anybody in this match, like they're gonna die in one hit. <laughs> Cause I'm a level 99. This guy's a 25, but the thought of helping him that what that what counts. But yeah, um, let's see here. Another thing I want to see in Xenoverse 3, uh, they do pretty good with the maps, but I want to see, okay, I want to see, okay, would it be dope if we could fight in Toki Toki City, which I know we can't do that, but you never know. Well, like a special thing happens like in story mode that allows you to fight in Toki Toki City, but not like actually fight, but like training. You know, like training with like friends or like rivals across the world. That would be dope. Because 1v1, that's not really training. I mean, like, training to, like, develop your skills and different attributes on your player. And then, what if you... Okay, also, another thing I want to see, too. What if you can copy somebody's moveset? Because another game that brings me back in, in, in the mind is Dragon Ball Z uh, Ultimate Tenkaichi for the 360. The, uh, the Rock, Paper, Scissors game. They did a good job of doing that. Because I have Vegeta's fighter style, so I was punching fast, and my guy was a heavy fighter. So, it was pretty dope. I put some clips of that, too, on the side so you, uh, so you guys can watch that. Because you guys will see the, uh, you guys can see what I'm talking about, what I mean by that. Actually, I think I got some gameplay there on my channel, but uh, you guys will see it in the video. But, yeah. 
that'd be kind of dope if we can have someone's move set. So you can have like Bardock's move set, like Broly's move set, or like Janemba's. Because some of these niggas in Dragon Ball Z so got a cold looking fire style. Like PyCon, for instance, he punched fast as hell. Boy, matter of fact, all these niggas punch fast, but some of them punch faster than others. You feel me? I'm gonna hit Goku with this power rush, so I guess not. Oh, he's went Kyle Keen. I almost killed him off of that. But it's not gonna be fair, bro. My guy is so strong. If I go Super Saiyan God, <laughs> it's gonna be GG. And another thing I wanna see in Dragon Ball Xenoverse 3, like I said earlier, this is not gonna be like the whole whistle. So like my next video, I when I do talk about Xenoverse 3, we'll have like the same stuff, but way more categories I wanna discuss. But another thing I want to talk about is in verse 3. Um, they, they they should make us go to like level 100 from the beginning. Because like, I don't know why like every time the game comes out, we got to wait for an update to get to 99. Like, like Bandai could just have that already from the beginning so we can just grind our players out. Because who wants to wait for an update to get to 85, to 90, to 95, to 99? They might as well just give us 100. Because that would be kind of dope if they did that. Oh, I almost hit him with the strongest attack in the game. <laughs> uh, but, uh, yeah, I missed that. But, like, that would be dope. We could be level 100 instead of 99. Though it's really no difference. But but it'll be, like, a slight, slight difference. Like, it's so many ideas I can discuss about Dragon Ball Xenoverse 3. It's ridiculous. Hey, man. Y'all niggas at Ben now need to tone down the prices, bro, on, on the little gift thing. It's 500... 500 TP medals to get an outfit, bro. Nah, GD, they should make it 200. But then again, everybody will be able to do it, though. But, bro, 500 TP medals, dog. That's, bro, if y'all play Xenoverse, you guys know that's a lot. Saiyan Blood. Oh, this, uh, this one, like the earlier ones right here. It's an easy one. <laughs> yeah, this guy must have just started the game or probably made a new character or something. Because we're doing easy parallel quest. <laughs> Piglo keep flying away. Oh, and also another thing. They need to fix the Xenoverse 2, man. I don't like how you punch somebody and then your punches don't go nowhere. They need to fix that in Xenoverse 3. It was okay in this game, but after a while, if you do like certain combos, you try to do like a stamina break. The stamina break would not occur. Of how the game is, like it's just so much stuff I can break down, man. You know, if you play Xenoverse, you can relate. Look at this nigga Gohan getting all mad, boy. You gonna get your, you know what? I'm I'm throwing a supernova. That's so disrespectful, but uh, parallel quest is so easy, bro. Goku about to get revived back up. But like I said, uh, Dragon Ball Z Inverse 2 was a, a success. I, like, I love this game. Like, it's like, like it's probably like my second favorite Dragon Ball Z game of all time. For real. Because, like, it's so much stuff you can do in this game. One one mode that I haven't played yet is the, um, what's that mode called? The little capsule thing? See, I ain't did that before yet. I'm probably never going to play that because I don't know what's the whole point of doing that. That's kind of like the ultimate team, like in Madden and stuff. But I'm going to be playing stuff like that. But hope you guys enjoyed this little quick video of Dragon Ball Xenoverse 2. The little quick. It's like a it's like a small little wishlist video. Nothing special. But like, comment, subscribe, and stay flight for more content. Let's get out! Ah!